my prosperity plan part two. If you're new to this page, I would advise that you watch this introduction video first so that you're not confused. This article is a part of a series of videos that I created outlining how all that I wrote in my journal came true over the past five years. There's a video series called Manifestation Journal on YouTube speaking about that process. This writing was inspired by a video that I made called My Prosperity Plan in October 2021. The video above was about a journal entry written initially in January 2018 titled My Prosperity Plan. See the actual entry below. This is the actual entry. And it was January 3rd, 2018. And it was my prosperity plan, how I was gonna get prosperous. Two pages. And then this video kind of sets the stage for um, this article. So I would suggest that you listen to it, but I won't play the whole thing right now. I'll just play the first minute. So these are the notes for this, uh, these are the notes that I have written. My, my prosperity plan is profound. I'm sure these beginning entries are. This shit is true. The fundamentals of how to bring shit into reality. Step by step. I think I knew, but I didn't know. I knew that I had found the secret and that I was doing what I said I thought what it said to do, but I didn't know I was writing the manual. As I read this first page now, I realize the importance of the fundamentals and achieving what one wants. These fundamentals are staple, are the staple law in terms of how to manifest shit on this plane. You must have a concrete plan for the who, the what, the when, and how. How the fuck are you getting there, and how the fuck is it going to look when you're getting there? When you get there, you must include the foundational aspects in the initial blueprint. I like how you were so confident in knowing how it was you were going to get what you needed. Although there was no commitment from Lance and therefore no guarantee whatsoever, you sure have me believing that you're going to get Lance to give you 250k for something you created in your head. LMAO. Good job, Rashawn. You set an intention and you backed it up with a set of directions on how it was you were to get there. You have made it very clear to us exactly what it is you want, which makes it, which makes giving it to you in the exact way that you want it much easier for us. We don't have any guesswork to do, and therefore you will get exactly what you want in the exact way that you want it. Your wish shall become our command. Thank you, Captain. That video went over these this entry, which was my exact plan for how I was going to become prosperous. And it included all that's right here. Marketing strategy, target market, product line, barriers to entry, staff requirements, funding requirements, funding allocation, owner's roles, profit projections, rebates, the whole shebang in regards to a detailed plan on how to start a company. This journal entry from 2018 really just inspired the hell out of me. Before I had anything I have now, I made a plan to get it. And I called that plan my prosperity plan. It's crazy how clear I was when originally writing this plan and the title of the journal entry speaks for itself. Here's a response from my higher self after rewatching the YouTube video I made titled My Prosperity Plan. So this is me speaking to myself as something other than myself. God in spirit, man in flesh, stop the worry, drop the stress. You're divine and you are blessed. Just move forward, do your best. Don't be foolish, it's a test. Be a ruler, not the rest. Ra. We can't communicate much clearer at this point. We're breaking all rules by literally bypassing synchronicity and literally communicating directly with you through mediums that are where you are, i.e. videos, that are literally talking to you and as close to real time as universally possible. We are either one second before or one second after you, so we can never sync up exactly at the same moment. But when we start talking to you on that one second shit, you better wake the fuck up. It's time. The time has come. It will be done. As on earth as it is in heaven. Remember always, you're a seven. Let's go, Ra. You trained for this your whole life. Day in and day out. 10,000 hours twice. You're as ready as you'll ever be. You can't practice anymore. You can't prepare anymore. You can't procrastinate anymore. You must put on the gloves 
and get in the cage and lock the door and fight. Fight as if your life depended on it. Because it does. You came here to serve a much bigger purpose than you can possibly even understand. Your hardware isn't built to run on that kind of bandwidth. It's bigger than you. Okay, now that we have your attention, let's talk. It's time for you to act on what you realized today after rewatching your prosperity plan video. You must move forward with certainty from this moment forward. You must battle doubt like it is what it really actually is. Your arch enemy, your divine nemesis, your other half, your shadow, the polar opposite aspect of your being. It's like planting those, those seeds of doubt, fear, and all that bullshit, worry, all that. It stops you dead in your tracks, and then we're stuck here, behind a fucking dead piece of weight, waiting for you to fight and begin taking forcefully the reins of the ship. Don't be weak, you are capable, you are raw, God on earth as it is in heaven. Step one, get some nice brochures made up using the theme from the marketing guide sheet and get them printed. 500 preferably, actually 500 minimum, and target those underserved communities listed on the PSEG talk point sheet. And don't say shit to me until you get them all out. You must do this. This is a test. I need you to complete this task as fast as possible so we can give you the next task. Time is of the essence. We have a lot to get done. We don't have any more moments to waste. We are neck and neck with good and evil, and we need to speed up and get back ahead. Rev, rev. But on another note, this all started because we focused your attention on the My Prosperity Plan video in your Docs app, and you were drawn to click it just at the moment you did because you are divinely guided, as always, in line with number seven. Just walk in certainty, and all that you are certain of shall find their way to you. What you want wants you back. Don't forget that. You made that video then for you now, and also then for you now, as well as then and now for you later. And then it will also circle back and you will be young again, middle-aged again, and old again. So understand that this is a game. It's a never-ending Taurus field of energy going into and out of itself infinitely over and over. It's the Ouroboros. It's a never-ending cycle of all there is, all there was, and all there ever be. It's a very hard concept to grasp while on Earth, because you're made to not know. It is not a privilege to know all that is when you are not willing to become all there is. If you want to play, then you can play, but down there, not up here. Up here, young lad, we are adults. Here, we are responsible. Here, we do the work for you to do whatever you want down there. But you need to listen to my prosperity plan over and over and over. The titles of my business plan chapters were crystal clear and exactly how it is, how it works, and how you work it. Be clear, be intentional, be specific, be outlandish, be yourself. Because we are churning the ship so that you can even have the chance to fuck the chance up. We serve you here and you serve us there. That's how it works. The more you can return to us, the more we can return to you. It's our harmonious balance forever and always. We need you and you need us, but you don't accept that truth. So in living your lie, you hinder our ability to stay in balance with you harmoniously, which is when we can do the most for you. We literally are all the partners you will ever need. You do not need any other partner. You have you and you have me. So you need to create an action plan for the next 10 steps to be done. Most important, then the second most important. And you need to begin operating from that sheet all the time. Check shit off, get good at it, get effective, execute. Start writing again and do it just the way you're thinking of doing it. Write whatever you feel like, but start checking those boxes on the brain off. Once you get all those articles written, you will attract the people, places, and things you need at once because you will be out there publicly and your unadulterated thoughts on there for everyone to see and to be inspired by and to learn from. This is you, you are him, he is you, you are one, you are new, you are Ra, son of God, creator of reality.